What's going on, ballers? Thanks so much for tuning in again, and welcome back to another Big J Basketball box break video. Um, the box we have in front of us is not really labeled, other than saying basketball, but if you looked at the description for the video and the thumbnail, you know that this is the Sports World Card Shop uh, mystery box. It's a mystery subscription box that they put together. I think it was around 150 or so bucks, somewhere in that range. Uh, maybe a little more with tax and shipping. Um, been a while since I opened one of these. I did a couple of these, um, I think last year, and it got to the point where products were getting so expensive. I really don't blame Sports World Card Shop. They were trying to keep the price reasonable, um, but you know, wax and, and uh, packs had been getting, getting so expensive that I think the last time I ordered it, I only got four packs for the same price. And I was like, eh, it's not that fun to open four packs, even though they were decent packs, uh, but prices have come down a little bit. So hopefully there's some good hobby packs uh, in here. So we'll open it up and we'll check it out. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, go ahead and hit that subscribe button, click that bell for notifications so you get notified whenever we post new stuff. Um, we did uh, some Donruss Blasters on Monday. We got more stuff coming later in the week and a bunch of them are coming next week too. All right, whoa, there's a lot of packs in here. So this is might be kind of kind of fun to open. Definitely a lot more packs. Like I said, last time I did one of these, there was only four packs in it. So hoping uh, I was hoping to open more packs and it looks like my wish was granted here. So let's just pull all this stuff out and we'll see how we do. Uh, so last Wednesday, we actually opened a uh, boom box, which I do pretty much every month. Um, and I figured, you know what, let's do another subscription box and we'll try and compare a little bit to see, not a, a really a battle to see which one wins, but two of the better cards we pulled out of boom box last week were with those two marbles out of Donruss. And let's uh, see if we can pull some just as good or better stuff out here. So we got Chronicles, two packs of Chronicles. These might be blaster packs, I'm guessing. Oh, Mega. Excel Mega, so this should be the teal parallels in here. We got Illusions, and this is probably, this is a blaster. Okay, so Illusions Blaster. Status, this was a T-Mall product from last year. Donruss, and this is Asia, so this is a T-Mall as well. We got Mosaic, five cards in here. This is again, ooh, Mosaic T-Mall. I actually have a full box of Mosaic Team All that I haven't opened yet, so that should be coming at some point soon. Uh, Revolution, this is probably the Asia, yeah, Team All Revolution as well. Hoops, let's see, are these Hobby? I'm not sure what these are. GC, eh, we'll find out when we open them. Ooh, Elite, 2122 Elite. These are definitely Hobby, so looking forward to these. And Donruss Hobby, okay, so we got some nice hobby packs uh, to close it out here. So we'll just do everything in the order. I think it makes sense to just do it in the order we uh, we had everything in. Yeah, let's just restack everything up and do it in this order and we'll see how we do. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12 packs. So very big difference from the uh, the four packs that we opened last time we did this. And actually, uh, Spurs Cards 21, watching his video the last time he did this is kind of what inspired me to try it out again. He pulled a, Pretty nice card, I'm not gonna spoil this video, but check out the last time he opened one of these and you'll see kind of why I got excited to rip into one of these again. Jayshon Tate, Kawhi Leonard, Patrick Williams. There, yeah, so these are from Omega, so that's the teal parallel. Giannis, oh, there we go, Lamelo XR right off the bat. So we'll put teal in the middle, uh, rookies in the middle with him, base on the right, okay. First pack, success, Mello XR, definitely a nice looking card one of the better looking base rookies uh i think and we got a teal i think essentials coming up killian hayes halliburton always nice to get halliburton throw him in the hit stack mike conley and we got a steph curry teal and a zion okay so those are the two packs of chronicles uh illusions this was yeah blaster pack still trying to put the illusion set together i think i'm like 20 or so cards away from completing this base set. So anything closer I can get is gonna be nice. Blake Griffin, ooh, we got a Donovan Mitchell. Shining Stars, Emerald, very nice looking card. I love the acetates uh, from Illusions. Got Christian Wood. Rookies are gonna be Reggie Perry and Sadiq Bey. Okay, so nothing crazy in Illusions, but I do like those acetates a lot. Here we go, Status from 1920. I never had really good luck opening these. I haven't opened a ton. I've only opened packs from like repack boxes, but never really pulled anything nice out of status. So maybe we can change our luck with this one. Got a Maxi Kleber, 
Buddy Heald, Kundari Weatherspoon rookie. I think he's on the Warriors actually now. I saw him uh, getting some playing time the other day. Darren Fox, we got a Porzingis, and that's a parallel. I think it's, I forget what it's called. I think it's like Rain or something like that, or no, the Rain was the, how, I think what Prestige called them with that same effect. I'm not sure what these are called. Hey, sh shout out Spurs Cars 21 and that Tim Duncan symbols insert. Throw him in the hit stack. We got Donruss Optic. This is going to be T Mall. Again, T Mall is, is tough to pull something really nice. There's, I think, maybe one gold wave per box, maybe a couple red waves, but. Ooh, and we got a red wave. There you go. Very nice. Harrison Barnes, Jonas Valanciunas. We got, oh, Wiseman base rookie, which I think I actually need this for the set. So that's a nice hit for me there. And our red wave, I think, is a rookie. Is it a Wiseman? Oh, it looked like the same colors at first, kind of, but as a Buki, red wave. But still, rookie red wave to pull out of one pack is, is not easy. That's pretty rare to get a rookie red wave out of just, you can open an entire box and not even hit one rookie red wave. But that would have been nice if that was a Wiseman. Mosaic team all. So there should be a red wave or gold wave per pack on this. And there we got a red wave on the back for sure. Zubots, Alfred Payton, Doug McDermott, Reggie Perry again. And our red wave. Ooh, it's a rookie too. Oh, and it's Jameis Ramsey. Oh, man. So we got red wave rookies in back-to-back -back packs. Unfortunately... Not the best rookies, but still nice hits. Nice uh, nice pulls to pull those red weight rookies. Uh, Revolution, Team All. I don't, I think I may have opened one of these packs. I know I didn't open a whole box. I think I opened, I can't remember when I, when I opened this, but I'm pretty sure I opened one. We got LeBron, base. Lonzo Ball. Ooh, come on. The Asia Parallel, I see Hornets. I see rookie. <laughs> Come on. We are getting so trolled on these parallels in every pack. Nick Richards. This is the Asia exclusive parallel too. Uh, yeah, it says Asia in the corner there. Okay. Another rookie parallel. Another troll. CJ McCollum and Nikola Jokic. Okay. Now we got the big stuff. I'm hoping these are hobby packs. They might not be. Again, GC, I forget what that means. I think hobby would say hobby, so these probably aren't hobby packs. Might be blaster, might be a retail pack. Should be able to find out uh, based on the configuration here when we open these. Bobby Portis, Drummond, Curry, McDermott, PJ Tucker, Mason Plumley. Ooh, no, this is a hobby pack because that's a hobby exclusive insert. There you go. Kawhi Leonard, Road to the Finals, number to 2021. Still not sure when he's going to come back and play. Hopefully soon. And oh, there you go. Already spoiled it. Luca Garza, rookie. Okay. So these are two. So we got two hoops hobby packs. And then we got a couple more hobby packs towards the end here. So here's another hoops hobby pack. Yeah, I thought I thought the hobby packs said hobby or HBY or something like that. But I might be confusing it with a different uh, with a different product. We got a hollow insert in here. Or hollow something. Kenyon Martin, John... Collins, Dylan Brooks, who just came back to the uh, lineup pretty recently. Jason Tatum, City Edition Hollow. And then our rookie is going to be Jeremiah Robinson Earl. Okay, so at least we did pull one numbered card out of the Hoops Hobby Pack. Okay, now we got the big stuff. So Elite, I'm a big fan of Elite. I really like ripping these packs. Although with only two packs, it's tough. Um, these are a lot better ripped in box form just because you get the two autos and two serial numbered rookies. So we could potentially get unlucky and not really pull anything out of here, but you never know. Yeah, so we just got an orange. If it's a rookie, it's numbered. If it's not, if it's a vet, it's not numbered. So we got Jay Crowder, Quickly, and Bede. And our orange is going to be Draymond Green. Kind of saw the Warriors logo. That would have been awesome if that was a Kaminga. But Draymond, nice color match there. Joe Harris, Bobby Portis, Blake Griffin, and the Joker. All right, we got one more pack of Elite, and then we'll do this Donruss pack last. Hopefully there's something good hiding in that Donruss pack, like a next day auto or like a short print parallel. All right, I'm going to try and do no peek on this one. Carl Anthony Towns, Boban, John Wall. Uh, I think we just got an insert. Yep, <laughs> Fred Van Vliet. 
Okay. Eh, acetates look nice, but obviously Fred Van Vliet's not a not a huge money maker. Siakam, Patrick Williams. Okay. So got skunked out of Elite, unfortunately, but we got one pack left. Come on, let's get something good out of this Donruss. Can we get another Marvels? Maybe a press proof Marvels would be really nice. Uh, only 10 packs per box on the Donruss, but only one auto and one mem uh, per box. So about a 20% chance at either uh, either one of those. All right, I kind of did see something shiny on the back, but don't want to spoil it. Let's, uh, let's fly through all this base. All right, let's get to the good stuff. And we got, we got rookies coming up here. So first rookie is gonna be Kai Jones. Charles Bassey, Isaiah Todd, Sharif Cooper, and Keon Johnson. So uh, not really great on the rookies and we might have a press proof, I think, behind here. TJ Warren press proof and again, they they don't number these anymore. Last year, these plain press proofs were numbered at 349. They just took the serial numbering off those this year. Inserts coming up. We got De'Aaron Fox. We got a Marvels. Come on, let's get someone good. That's gonna be James Harden. Not really the guy we're looking for, but still nice looking card. Uh, he's already not on the Nets anymore. <laughs> uh, we got a Retro Series, Bill Russell. And maybe a press proof back here. Crunch time, Anthony Edwards. No press proof though. This is the second hobby pack I think I've opened that didn't have a press proof insert, which is kind of surprising, but we should have something serial numbered uh, back here, I think. Uh, that's not a rookie. That's gonna be Jamal Murray. 75th anniversary card numbered 59 of 75. So definitely a nice looking card. Jamal Murray, hopefully, now I'm hearing it's 50-50 that he may or may not even come back uh, this season. So we'll have to see what happens with him. But that's going to do it for this break. Um, let's see, did we did we pull anything better than these two Marvels back there? No, I'm not quite sure. Got Jamal Murray, numbered 75. James Harden, Marvels. Got a Kawhi, numbered 2021. And we got trolled on all the rookies here. Got a Nick Richards, Revolution, Team All Parallel, LeBron. Got a Jameis Ramsey, Red Wave. As a Buki Red Wave, we got a Wiseman base, Tim Duncan, Donovan Mitchell, Tyrese, and LaMelo. So yeah, I think we probably pulled some better cards out of the Boombox last week. Uh, but again, Boombox is more expensive than this, and this was still, still pretty fun to rip. So uh, that's going to do it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed that. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you all on the next video.